and the latest on the shocking death of a popular local judge. Downtown's district courthouse, a somber place today. Flags flew at half staff in honor of a legal icon. Judge Bob Schwartz's death came unexpectedly Monday. He died of pneumonia, which he came down with in the hospital where he was being treated for a broken leg. The legal community is mourning his loss. News 13's Alex Goldsmith is live at the courthouse. Alex? Dick, Jessica, it was uh, besides the flags at half staff outside, it was really business as usual at district court today. But there was an empty chair inside, one where one of the court's most colorful judges sat. We just can't believe he's gone. Much too young. On the top floor of Albuquerque's district courthouse sits Judge Bob Schwartz's courtroom, now empty. To the left of his chair on a shelf sits a statue of justice and a party hat, the perfect symbols for a man who many people considered both funny and fair. A brilliant mind, uh, a wonderful sense of humor. And an important legal figure for decades. Schwartz was Bernalillo County's DA for eight years, was nearly elected mayor in 2001, even served in the Richardson administration as crime czar before he was appointed to the bench four years ago. In statements, Bernalillo DA Kerry Brandenburg says Schwartz will be mourned. Former Governor Bill Richardson called him a crime fighter to the core. Chief District Judge Ted Baca said this about his fellow judge. You know, none of us are perfect, and sometimes that's what I liked about him. As a judge, I thought he was an extraordinary judge. He Schwartz's death comes at a time of post-election transition for the district court. Judges Samuel Winder and Brett Loveless were both voted out a week ago, meaning there will soon be three new criminal judges. Now it's time to make some decisions. His cases will be handled. There will be no unnecessary delays in his cases. None of the cases will fall through the cracks. We might use a pro tem judge for a while until we can get a replacement for Judge Schwartz, but uh, it's going to be tough to go on without him. Judge Schwartz's humor wasn't just confined to the courtroom. For a time, he also tried his hand at stand-up comedy. Back to you. Okay, Alex Schwartz was also controversial sometimes. Two years ago, the state Supreme Court publicly reprimanded him for having a relationship with a public defender who had cases before him. 